Hey Cats fans, it's Ben Reeve here from The Hoop Show and welcome back for part 5 of Player Previews for 2023. I'm losing track of it here, but uh, well, I, think I've kept, I think we're up to part 5 anyway. So this list we've got uh, Sam, and, Sam and Angola, forgotten man a little bit, uh, Ollie Dempsey, Cam Guthrie, Tom Atkins and Brian Myers. Brian. Uh, so we'll start with Sam Angola. Uh, again, a bit of a forgotten man last year, starting to become a little bit of a whipping boy. Uh, among Cats fans, and we probably just need to steer away from that a little bit. Uh, he's, he's not a bad player, Sam Managola. I reckon he'll be in the side for most of the year. Um, now, I'm not having a crack at him here. I know I was saying everyone, don't don't treat him as a whipping boy. I don't think he'll be there in round one, and I don't think he'll be there on grand final day, but I think he'll be an integral part of the side for the majority of the year. Um, 18 games, I'm predicting him to play. Um, he's he'll be on the fringe. Uh, doesn't mean just because someone's on the fringe doesn't mean I'm going to have a crack at them. Um, he's, still, he's still giving it everything he's got, but um, it's going to be a hard team to crack this year. And uh, I think I think we'll go with him for most of the year, but uh, we'll see what happens at the end. Uh, he might he might be there round one. He might be there grand final day. He might be both. Uh, he might not miss a game, uh, or he might not play at all. Who knows? But that, that's where I'm at on him. Uh, Ollie Dempsey, I'm confident we'll see a lot more of Ollie Dempsey this year. I think we'll see Ollie in the side, especially the first two-thirds of the year. I reckon we'll, we'll get 10 games out of Ollie uh, early doors. Hopefully we do, because I like watching him play. Um, he's good fun. Um, don't, don't, oh, do I see him round one? No, probably not round one. Um, but I, And I don't see him grand final day, but... Um, I think we'll see a fair bit of him, as I said, in the first part of the year. I think we'll get a few games out of him, maybe 10, 8 or 10 games out of Ollie Dempsey, which would be really nice for him. Uh, now, Cam Guthrie, round one. Clearly, Cam Guthrie's uh, one of our first picked. Uh, clearly, you, you have him on grand final day every every day of the year, if you play grand final every day of the year. Um, he's not going to miss too many games, I wouldn't have thought. I think he'll play 25 games or so. Uh, and I actually think he'll be an All-Australian this year. I think he'll step it up another level again. Um, potentially even get a third Carnegie Greaves medal uh, if he keeps it going. So that'll be nice, wouldn't it? So, yeah, really feeling very positive about Cam Guthrie now. I think he's really uh, become one of the absolute elite players in the comp. Uh, we, we do forget sometimes that he was, I think he was an emergency in the 2011 grand final as well. Can't believe that. Um, one of the emergencies for that grand final, um, but didn't didn't quite play. He was on the list uh, going around then anyway. So it might have been his first year, played a couple of games, but uh, we went with... Alan Christensen and uh, young Mitch Duncan at the time there. Uh, Tom Atkins, Tom, round one, grand final, lock him in. Uh, not a problem. Uh, 25 games, uh, just shy of another of an All Australian, I reckon, for Tom. He's he's gonna probably that is gonna be his story at the end of his career. He's he's a great player, which didn't get the accolades, but that's okay. We still love him anyway, because he's a heart and soul kind of player, and that's that's what we want. That's what we love at Geelong. Uh, and Grind Myers, uh, not a lot of love for Grind Myers last year, but I think he proved people wrong throughout the year, and I think we started to understand his role a lot more. Um, I've, I've got Grind being there, you know, hardly missing a beat all year round. I think we'll see him, uh, yeah, round one, grand final day, uh, wherever. Uh, he'll, he'll be fantastic. Might be all Australian. I think he'll probably be a little bit more prolific in front of goal this year. Him and um, he'll take a few more off Tyson Stengel this time around. Um, I think he'll understand his role a lot better uh, for a full season now. Um, and hopefully we'll see him through the midfield a little bit more than what we do as well. So I'm really, really feeling good about Grind Mize in uh, 2023. What did you think, though? Sam Managola, do you, you probably disagree with me there. I'm sure most people watching this would disagree that he's going to play 18 games, but that's okay. Um, I would love to get your thoughts on that in the chat. Um, good or bad, I don't mind. Uh, Ollie Dempsey, are you hopeful of Ollie Dempsey? Cam Guthrie, I think we will probably all agree that Cam's a lock. Uh, Tom Atkins as well. Uh, but what are you thinking about Grind Myers? He's another one that uh, he's, can be polarising among the fan support, supporter group around where how he's going and uh, what he's going to give us. Anyway, let me know in the chat. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Do all that like and subscribe stuff. It really does help the channel as we build and grow. Um, yeah, really appreciate that. And uh, I'll see you on part six coming up soon. Check out the other episodes in the show notes as well. All right, see you guys. Bye.